In the beginning, there was good, and oh, well, not so good. Next, two tiny amoeba met in a singles pool on the outskirts of Microcosm. Later that same night... Hey, baby! You want to get lucky? Ooh, sure! And out of that incursion, a paramecium. Next came fear, acoustic ceiling tiles, velour turtleneck sweaters, and the inception of Ronco Incorporated. With that in mind, our story. From Dam Productions, we present... Beer Quest! The year 2001. The place, Annapolis, Maryland. The Soviets in the Kremlin have completed video outposts in most of the devastated cities across the United States. In order to study the United States population in their effort to live in the radioactive environment imposed on them by the Russians. Radio announcements fill the air for those who have radios. From the United States government... These are rough times. But I feel optimistic that now, finally, after our defense system blew a fuse and the Russians have left us helpless with their nuclear warheads, that our economic condition will improve. The situation looked pretty grim. But I know you can't tell because you're just listening, but believe me, it looked pretty grim. Yet even though the country was gripped in a national crisis, there was hope. For deep in the heart of the land of Mary, and very deep, our heroes were busily setting in action the events that would change the face of this ravaged nation forever. Our roster of characters includes the most heroic and courageous beer hunters known in the annals of history. Or in other words, the biggest bunch of in America. There was the technological wizard, Butch the Bitchy, one of the most shortest mentally deranged sound engineers ever to grace the famous Noise Boys basement studio of Lensland. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I like him. I like the guy. Oh. Real man. There was Russ the Lustful of the rustling hair, professional balsa wood stylist and comb clipper. Yeah. All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And yours truly, Bud the Brewmeister. A man who has devoted his entire life to all that is yellow and frothy. Uh, yeah. Thanks, guys. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. As our story unfolds, we find three meek and mortal men crouched in the corner of a damp, drab, dilapidated basement. Candles dimly illuminate the shattered, leaky room. A slight twinkle of candlelight cuts through the many shadows to reveal that the ceiling boards have begun to leak with the acid rain from outside. That's it! We finished off the last six-pack. The rats have lapped up the last can. There's none left! This sucks. Maggot the Merciless has captured Barb, the goddess of Logger. And with her, he can change any of the billions and billions and billions of radioactive six-packs into drinkable brewski by having her malaise it. Hey, Bud, where's Butch the Bitchy? He passed out trying to figure out how the compressor works. <laughs> oh, no! We'll never get that last track down. <laughs> I don't care! I can't take it! Maggot the Merciless has the college population of America by the short hairs! Our sound engineers passed out on the mixing board, and I'm... I'm fed up! I can't take it anymore! Oh, I'm... Oh, I'm too tired to be hysterical right now. Pass me the Bretzels, would you less? 
Sure, bud, here you go. Uh. Believe me, bud, I understand how you feel. We can never get through the entire winter like this. We've got to do something. Action! We've got to move! Our forefathers wouldn't sit here like this. We need fortitude! Allegiance! We need to beat this maggot the Merciless! And save Barb, the goddess of Lager, and free the world! Uh, give me the pretzels, bud. Yeah, let's see it go. Our heroes begin their trek after Maggot the Merciless. After this commercial break. Ace Mover. Ace Mover. Ace Movers. With our new no loss guarantee. If we break it. <laughs> no no loss to us. Yeah. Mm. And now, back to our story. Lust the Lost Bull and Bud the Brewmeister begin the long journey to free Barb, the goddess of Logger, in their spacer. With Butch dozing bitchly in the back seat and Bud licking salt from the bottom of the pretzel bag, our heroes raced across the deserted plains of the land of Mary, past the gutted out liquor stores and long forgotten pizza joints. It was not a happy land. Meanwhile, at the Merciless Palace, No, I can't bless any more beer. <laughs> no, no, stay away from me. Very well. Bring me into the next flash. But less. But I'm, I'm too, too tired. I, I said for less. <laughs> Thy foamy phantom turned to golden lager. Thy movie phantom turned to golden lager. <laughs> Turn away. You, you awful man, you. You can't get away with this, you know. I said that you get the wind out of hell. God. Unhand me, guard. <laughs> Come on, babe. Let's blow this chilly dog stand. Join us next week when we continue our exciting episode. And we'll also answer the plaguing questions. Will Les ever get his pretzels back? Will Butch ever wake up? Will these three guys ever get home again safely? Join us in our next continuing stop of Beer Quest! Quest.